glad you made it. All right, so today we're gonna get kind of woken up. I need everybody to make sure you are one, two, three, standing up. So that's the way that you can get the best breath possible and which also means the best singing possible. What we're going to do is we are going to make a fire engine sound. I will demonstrate. It goes like this. I hope it's not too early in your house right now that you're gonna be waking people up. But let's try it, are you ready? And you notice I did a little hand thing while I did it. That seems to help. So do the hand thing while we do it. Here we go. Let's do another one, ready, go. All right, well, if everybody wasn't awake in your house, they probably are now. <laughs> Tell them Mrs. the so sorry. All right, next thing, you're gonna find that diaphragm muscle. You know that it is right under that breastbone there and you can make it flex when you, when you do like CHs and things like that. So I'm gonna do some CHs and then I want you to do it and see if you can make that little muscle flex, flex, flex when you do a CH, okay? Me first. Ch, 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 ch. Your turn. Ch, 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 ch. My turn. Your turn. My turn. Your turn. Good. All right. So um, during the month of October, we were doing all of our warm ups. Not in major, but do you remember what we call this? Minor. Yeah, this is minor. But we're going to switch back to major today. And we're gonna start with some oohs. Ready? Take a nice big breath, like you're gonna make another fire engine sound, right? And on an oo. when you do the hots, all right? Now, if you feel any sort of pain or tension in your throat when you're doing it, then you're using the wrong muscle. You're using your throat muscles. Don't use your throat muscles. Use this muscle down here, okay? All right, I've got some lame jokes for you again. Are you ready? Here we go, lame joke number one. How do pickles enjoy a day out? They relish it. Ha, 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 ha. science books say to the math books book <laughs> wow you've got a lot of problems <laughs> This is a good, this is a clock joke because we uh, set the clocks back this past weekend. Why did the kid throw his clock out the window? He wanted to see time fly. <laughs> All right, very good. All right, now. Uh, do you remember our do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do and all the hand signs that go with it? Let's find out. Do them with me. Do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do. Now, can you go backwards? Do, ti, la, so, fa, mi, re, do. Good. So we're going to do that. And we're going to go all the way up and all the way down. If you can do the hand signs while you do it, I will be totally impressed. One, two, oh, get a nice big breath. See if you can do it all in one breath. What do we call that when we make sure that we have enough breath for the whole phrase? We call it breath maintenance. Take a nice big breath. Here we go. Do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do, ti, la, so, fa, mi, re, do. Can't do it a 
as fast as I can, rewind this, practice it, see if you can get up to the same speed that I'm doing. And then if you can sing it up to my speed, then see if you can do the hand signs up to my speed. That would be totally awesome. Good job. All right, guys. Remember how I was talking about minor before? I'm gonna give you a little minor major quiz. So I'm either gonna play a chord, and a chord is three or more notes played at the same time. I'm gonna play a chord that is either major or minor. And let's see if you can figure out which is which. Here's the first one. If you said major, good job. Here's the next one. If you said minor, bravo. Next one. That one is also minor. Next one. What do you think? If you think that one is major, very good. All right, I'm gonna do one more. Here we go. And if you said that one was major, very good. You are correct. All right, I'm gonna teach you a new round today. It's called Hey Ho, Nobody Home. Hey Ho, Nobody Home. And it goes like this. Hey ho, nobody home. Meat nor drink nor money have I none. Yet will I be merry, very merry. That's it. There are three lines to this round. All right, me first, you second. Hey ho, nobody home. Try it. Hey ho, nobody home. Good. Now, as always, I will put a link up to the lyrics for this. In addition to that, I will put up a YouTube video link up that will show you the lyrics as you're singing it. And it even does it as a round. All right. All right. So we already did the first line. Let's do the second line. Meat nor drink nor money have I none. Try it. Meat nor drink nor money have I none. I'm gonna put the first line and the second line together. Me first. Hey ho, nobody home. Meat nor drink nor money have I none. Try it. Hey ho, nobody home. Meat nor drink nor money have I none. How we doing? Well, if you need more practice, you know what to do. Rewind it and give it another whirl. All right, here is the third line, and it goes like this. Yet will I be merry, very merry. Try it. Yet will I be merry, very merry. Good. All right, so now I'm going to do all three lines together. Me first, you second. Hey ho, nobody home. Meat nor drink nor money have I none. Yet will I be merry, very merry. <laughs> Try it. Here we go. Hey ho, nobody home. Meat nor drink nor money have I none. Yet will I. All right, hopefully you've got that down pat or pretty close to it. Um, you know what I really like about this round? It's a great round, but on top of it, I like that it's just saying, hey, you know what, uh, I, don't have, <laughs> I don't have a lot, but I'm gonna choose to be happy. That's basically what this is saying. Yeah, so sometimes you just gotta choose to be happy, right? <laughs> All right, so here's what I'm gonna do. I am gonna play uh, the music for this. The first time through, we do it in unison. What is unison? Unison is when we all sing together as one, all right? And then the second time through, it's gonna be broken off into two different parts for our round. And we are going to sing part one, all right? And then the next time through, they're gonna put it into three different parts, right? <laughs> How many parts can you have for a round? As many as you want, right? So three different parts. So um, we are going to be part number three, all right? And when we do it, every time we do it, we sing it two times through. Does that all make sense? Just follow me. I'll help you. <laughs>
part three. Wait for me to come in, okay? Here's the first part coming in. This is part two coming in. The next challenge is, if you need to bump it up a level, uh, you know, I'm going to put the link on of this YouTube video for you to do with it. Try doing the different parts. Try coming in first. Try coming in second. Try coming in third. Then, if that gets really easy and you're like, Miss Haven, this is no big deal. This is easy peasy lemon squeezy. Aha! Well, then I'm going to give you the ultimate challenge. And the ultimate challenge is that you have to teach it to somebody else. Like maybe somebody in your house. Your mom, your dad, your brother, your sister, aunt, uncle. Grandma, Grandpa, whoever, teach it to them and see if you can do it as a round with them, okay? All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed our song today, and I will see you next time.